So Ultimate Spell Book is back. That's when I decided to play Captain Fucking Teemo. And I don't never really knew why. I went ahead with the Kale Alt and we're being invaded. While everyone is dying, I'm sitting in the bush waiting for the enemy top laner to come. That's when I realized he's still invading. So he'll miss these first three minions. And he should be back now. That's why I'm waiting in this bush. He's not here. Must be running a little late or something. So I pushed a wave in, now it's crashing. I'm taking the first plating. Taking the second plating, clearing another wave. And then I was on my third plating. That's when not Mod Kaiser shows up. Kane. Close enough. So I tried to flash auto kick Night Kane, but I didn't have Ignite. So he just walked away. But that's okay because I'll just take another plating since Mod Kaiser is taking his sweet time coming to lane. He's coming, trust me guys. I saw the bitch participate in that invade and then not Mod Kaiser shows up again and tries to kill me. So I ran for my life until I realized it's not me who should be running. It was him. He's, he's the one who should be running. That's when Mod Kaiser showed up. Told you guys it was coming to lane. Well, I'm going to go buy an entire full item on my first pack. This will be fair. Am I the type of guy to use my Nash's Tooth to kill Mod Kaiser? Who's still level 5? Yeah, totally. I mean, I'll take the rest of the plating as well. Since I'm here, I might as well take the rest of the wave. Since I'm here, I might as well take mid wave. I mean, since I'm here, I might as well go for the first plate. Second plating. Third plating. Is anyone going to stop me? Oh, look, Samira's here to stop me. So I'm going to stand still and kill like a tyrant. Since I'm here, I might as well be the jungle as well. And that's when I found Kane trying to counter jungle me. Get the fuck out of my jungle, Kane. So I took my red buff, and then I looked to kill this little rat who's still in my jungle. I gave Kane two auto attacks, that's actually all I need. And now Samira's here to stop me. Now, I know I'm the kind of guy to kill Mod Kaiser with my Nash's Tooth, but am I the kind of guy to kill Mod Kaiser with my Nash's Tooth and my Rift Maker? While standing still? Yeah, 100%. I then went back and bought a Rabadon's death cap. I had $4,000. Three full items at 12 minutes. I mean, if we're gonna play Teemo, I might as well play Teemo, you know? Now I'm invisible in the mid lane waiting for someone to show up. But everyone's jerking off in the bot lane and don't care about me, so I just go ahead and kill this tyrant. Actually, Kane cares and he tries to look for me, so I... Kill him through the wall. Also, this is Rayla. She's probably the strongest person who might be able to kill me. While I'm standing still, that is. I then took Dragon, Blue Buff, Gromp, Turret, and now Mokaz is trying to catch this wave to level up. Am I really the kind of guy to kill him while I was just trying to? Yes, I fucking am. And here's Samira coming in to stop me again. She likes doing that, stopping me, except it never works. But here comes Pike, who can actually stop me. Except I have Kale Alt, which makes me invulnerable. I then went back and bought my final item and a pot at 16 fucking minutes. I was pretty menacing, to say the least. I then soloed Baron. I forgot to take the Herod. I'm level 17 and Mod Kaiser, he's level 11. It was at this time I wrote in all chat, if they beat me, I'll give them free skin codes. There's absolutely no way I'm gonna lose. I just wanted to milk the content and make sure they don't surrender. Okay, but actually, there's no way I'm actually losing this one, guys. Like, seriously, like, don't actually get your hopes up. Like, actually. If I'm going to play Teemo Pike, I'm going to play Teemo. And I did absolutely everything to make them feel like they can win. Give them a little bit of hope. Give them that light at the end of the tunnel. And then... Bonk. And when they think victory is within grasp. Yes! Skin cold! I will go over to the strongest guy. And stand still. You never had a fucking chance. Nice, nice try. So that was my first game of Ultimate Spellbook Teemo, and I got this Teemo high like I never had before. And I just wanted more of it. So the enemy bot lane was pretty low after double killing my bot lane. I first blinded Leona, so she doesn't stun me. Now I kill Lucian. After Lucian, Leona. Give me a second, Set. You're blinded. Let me just kill Leona. That was when Set grabbed my shirt and pinned me against the wall. Now, Set, I believe you have two options here. When I was in such a submissive state, I could have either flashed to the top right bush, or the correct answer, the alcove. But it's definitely not the left bush because there's no way my flash could reach that far. So what's it gonna be, Set? The alcove or the top right bush? I'm ready to face my fate. 
You fucking idiot. XX Pro Gamer. XX. Wow. This guy. This guy is good. I must move with precautions. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. You guys might not see it, but I can sense his bloodlust. And the moment I step within his striking distance, I'm a dead man. So, actually, I'm just going to clear the minions. That's when I look at the clock and it was already 16 minutes. I'm one minute late to killing Baron. Pro Gamer really knew what he was doing. I forgot the Herald. And they surrendered. We got the ass shot this time. Hey guys, I'm just here to catch the wave. Don't mind me. But Brand was so angry. It was probably in this moment Brand's mind was telling him no. But his body. Took a fucking ash arrow to the face. And so Bran seeked revenge. This time he took a charm, an ash arrow, and a Lux ult to the face. But Bran wasn't gonna let anything stop him there. He was going to- That was when Bran finally figured it out. Hatred and anger was turning his world upside down. But the compassion and empathy he feels was all completely bullshit. Because Vexalt just fucking sucks. What the fuck? A blast cone. Yo, Brian, do you have a discount code for Ironside Computer? I'm looking to get a new PC. I'd even tell this guy to say this, but while well, I'm at it, use code PR to 5% off. The 15 minute mark is coming up. You know what time it is. It's time to kill the purple guy. Oh. Kha'Zix? Yeah, not the guy. I need to clear the area of any fake purple men. All clear. Time to kill the purple guy. And I forgot the Herald. Or did I? Haha. <laughs> Character development, bitch. Where the fuck were you this whole time? Wait. No. Don't tell me. No. My Gromp. No, no, tell me the wolves of the earth, please! Please, no! No! You know what? Fuck you, Brand. This is all your fault. Kenan, I'm just gonna give you a couple of hits here just to let you know I can kill you, but I'm not gonna kill you. I'm not that kind of guy. After clearing the wave, I went invisible as fast as I can, and I made it one frame. Literal one frame in time. And I think I jump scared this Kenan that he flashed. Probably pressed every key on his keyboard. Alright, five more minutes until I can, I did not know you could surrender at ten minutes in this mode. I wonder if I can sneak past. Oh, yes sir. Oh, yes sir, this is a good spot. This might be my best spot yet, right in between the buttons. I never expect this one. And now 15 minutes, I'm right on time. Do you need help, Timo, or am I just getting in the way? Get the fuck away from me! Jinx, you're getting in the way! Yeah, get out of here. I can sell a Baron at 15 minutes. A jungler can't even do that. Shouldn't call themselves a jungler. I forgot my fucking Herald!